was for uh, Courtney Alberti. Well, thank you. Thank you, Madam Speaker. I want to thank my colleague for his speech. And he talked about small businesses, some of the challenges that they're facing. Dave Ball, who owns Vancouver Island Wine and Beer Making, he got a loan, a SIBA loan. And five months ago, the government announced the increase to the SIBA loan. And he applied for it. Now there's a tech, uh, technical issue and he can't get the increase. So here we are five months later. We, he can't get the increase. We hear there's 60,000 businesses in the same position. We've written to the minister. We can't get a reply. There's no hotline for him to call to get information about his application. And in fact, we've been asking the government to increase the, the loan, the SIBA loan from 60,000 to 80,000 because we're in the third wave where many businesses are struggling to survive. Could the, my colleague share if he has uh, constituents in the same situation that have applied for the SIBA loan extension but can't get an answer whether they're going to get it or not. And if he thinks that we should increase it for those businesses that need extra help, especially those in hospitality and tourism and those being impacted mostly greatly by the pandemic. The Honourable Member for Prince, uh, Caribou Prince George. Thank you, Madam Speaker, and thank you to my colleague, uh, Honourable BC, or uh, from uh, uh, Courtney Alberni as well, too, who reminded me of another thing. Absolutely, I've heard the exact same thing, um, Madam Speaker. We have we're we're failing small businesses, and we need to do more for them, Madam Speaker. He he also reminded me of something that I failed to to mention in my speech, and that is the opioid crisis, opioid crisis in British Columbia. We are facing dire times, not only just here in our province, but right across our country, and this budget fails to do anything for that. Madam Speaker, we need to do better for those who are struggling with mental health and addiction, and this budget falls short.